Okay. Now, we actually get a more tractable situation mm -hmm. if we try to do this equation. Okay? Uh, it's, it, it, no, it's not more tractable, it's different. Okay? Here we get a linear, a velocity that's linear with respect to x. Linear in x. If we have actually probably the more common I don't like to use K, they like to use K. I'm going to use a delta, lowercase delta V squared, okay? Then you have MV dV dt equals negative delta V squared, which leads to the integral of dV over V equals the integral and it's not dV dt x. Okay? My hand was low, my brain was doing mainly because my brain wasn't doing anything. Okay, so we have this. Um, then we're going to have negative delta over M Uh, and it's, yeah, divide by the V. So you get the natural log, the absolute value of V equals negative delta over Mx plus an integration constant. So that V equals A E to the negative delta over Mx. Okay? And the steps here, you know, here to here, is just the standard stuff that we've encountered in different situations at least three or four times now. Okay? Just simple exponential. So your velocity decays exponentially with your distance from the orbit, from the wall, whatever it is. Okay? Now, This is, A has to be V of zero because when X is zero, you have to get V of zero. When X is zero, your exponential term is zero, the factor is zero, and just left with A equals V of zero. So that's not totally straightforward. Okay? So that's two really common situations. It applies to me pushing off the wall, depending on whether we have this or this. Okay? Now I do observe that when I push off the wall, I do eventually come to rest. But this doesn't predict I do. This predicts I keep moving. Very, very slowly. Okay? But I don't ever come to rest. However, as I slow down, I go from where the net force is proportional to v squared where the net force is proportional to V, and this one does stop. Okay? So whenever I make the transition, I stop. And the same for boat pushing off the dock, which is a problem we were looking at. Okay? Um, I don't know what's easier to relate to. I always consider the experience of swimming, which I assume everybody's done some of, pushing off a wall. Uh, so it's, you, you, you kind of have a more visceral relationship to that phenomenon if you've done that, okay? And most people have. Um, but you can also, you know, I'd say more people have had that experience of pushing a boat off the dock, okay? Well, those are both fairly common experiences, at least more before everybody started using their thumbs or anything. Uh, okay? Uh, yeah, um, so anyhow, there it is. Okay, pretty straightforward. 
although still understanding this MV, DV, DX thing. Um, you know, I mean, you, 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 you have to accept it by the chain rule, yeah. Yeah. but what in the bleep does that mean? Okay, why is it, why is it what it is?